Diablo, El Diablo, El Diablo. Good evening. I'm pretty, I'm actually pretty happy today. We're not talking about you though. Sorry. We're talking about your worst enemies, these guys, these little convict cichlids here. Specifically, I'm talking about these guys' aggression. I have to say something very important. I think. What's up, fish fam? I'm Dan from Michigan Aquatics. I'm talking about the convicts. So, basically, their aggression. Everyone's seen this video. There's a video on YouTube of this jaguar cichlid that is in a corner, and these convicts are just plummeting it. They're just going to town on this jag. What are you doing? Hanala, leave him alone. These convicts are just going to town on this jaguar cichlid. And everyone down there is like, nobody messes with the mighty convict. But their aggression is sort of like an Oscars or a Jack Dempsey's. They're aggressive until the thing really starts to fight back. Hard. What I mean is, here is a example. This guy comes out and he's all mean to this thing, you see? All mean flaring up at it. You can see even the females going after it, but watch this. They just move out of the way when something comes at them. I wish they'd do what they usually do to this thing. But they just... See? Just like that. They just get out of the way when something comes at them. See that? Just move right out of the way. Oh, gosh darn it. Boom, just like that. Just move out of the way. If something is actually coming at them to attack them, as you can see, these fish aren't gonna do nothing. The issue with most regular old jags is they don't want to do that. Well, not that they don't want to do that, it's because they're outnumbered. Two to one. There's only one convict in there, it doesn't even have to be a female. If there's one, they're going after it, and they're going to kill it. It's happened many times with these guys, and the jag has actually taken over their territory. They just want it back, so they keep trying to take it over. Then the jag just rushes over here, and they go everywhere. They're not very persistent attackers. Um, so their aggression is extremely mild, believe it or not. They're aggressive till the point something really tries to fight back, and they do not keep attacking after the thing leaves them alone. Because once the thing leaves their territory, they don't care about it. It's not their territory, it's not their problem. A jag, on the other hand, keeps attacking it. Don't worry, this catfish will be removed. But no matter where in the tank this thing goes... It's getting attacked and pushed up to the top, and any time the Jag comes out of his hideout and sees it, he attacks the living crap out of it. These guys are horrible fighters. See, when they go in to attack, they go bing, and then they just like bounce off. It's like they hit and they bounce off. They don't stay there and fight. Very weak and pathetic attackers. In their aggression, when they flare, all they do is sit there and go like this. But as the thing moves closer to them, what do they do? They go like this. Move backwards and backwards and backwards. All of a sudden, they're in the corner, and they just go, Wee! and they just swim away. Pretty dang pathetic. Now, I've, I, these guys have been held back by the Jag a lot before. Um, I'm, I mean, the Jag was held back by them. All right? So, that's because he used to respect that as his territory. But as I started removing rocks, because he's getting bigger, now he wants more territory. So he really wanted their territory. He soon figured out, oh, they're not going to do nothing to me. So what he did was he would sit right here on top of this rock, and they'd just sit there and flare at him all day long. And he'd just sit there. Eventually, they turned their back, and he just went, and they just went everywhere. And it's been like that every single day from now. I'm telling you. Convicts are nothing. They're small. They're they're pretty strong. They got a small mouth. They're small, pathetic at fighting. The only thing they are is good parents, which 
they've actually laid eggs as you can see he's in there trying to fertilize them but they've laid eggs and the jag still goes over there and goes in there and eats them no matter how much they're plummeting him they suck if anyone wants to have any arguments about convict aggression I'm doing a live stream tonight alright tonight at um like I don't even know I don't even think I'll get this published today I might and if I do um check my channel at six o'clock at night um because at six o'clock I'm having a live stream so if you find this within the two hours you guys have after me up uploading this then you can argue with me about convict aggression all you want I'm saying though they're pathetic been an owner of them they give up way too easy anyway that's all for this convict cichlid aggression video I hope you all enjoyed if you did hit that like button I mean a lot as well as I'm doing some things on the channel I'm getting new things made so I cannot wait for them to come out I'll see you all in the next one everybody love y'all keep them fishes happy you gotta keep the fishes happy if you don't El Diablo gets angry. El Diablo is the leader of all your guys' cichlids, alright? All your guys' cichlids bow down to the mighty El Diablo. Hope you all enjoyed this video, though. And fish on.